The Depository Trust Company, founded in 1973 and based in New York City, is one of the world's largest securities depositories. It provides electronic record keeping of securities balances and acts like a clearinghouse to process and settle trades in corporate and municipal securities. Because the DTC is an automated system, it lowers trading costs, improves accuracy, and increases the number of trades that can occur each day. Before the DTC existed, the New York Stock Exchange had grown so popular that it was having trouble handling its trade volume, which was then in excess of 8 million shares per day. Thanks in part to the DTC, the NYSE now can handle billions of shares per day. Jenna is the CFO of XYZ Corp, an institutional investor. She uses the DTC as a custodian for XYZ's corporate stocks and bonds, municipal bonds, and money market instruments. It settles funds at the end of each trading day using the Fedwire Funds Service. She trusts the DTC because it is registered with the SEC, is a member of the Federal Reserve System, and is owned by many companies in the financial industry, with the NYSE being one of its largest shareholders. Jenna not only uses the DTC as a custodian for XYZ's investments, she also uses it to manage XYZ's own shares. In addition to safekeeping, record keeping, and clearing services, the DTC provides direct registration, underwriting, reorganization, and proxy and dividend services. For example, when XYZ Corp. declares a dividend, the DTC announces it, collects the dividend payment from XYZ, allocates dividends to shareholders, and reports those payments. Securities, brokers, dealers, institutional investors, depository institutions, issuing and paying agents, and settling banks use the DTC. But when Jenna places trades in her own account as an individual investor, she does not interact with the DTC. Her financial institution does.